A beloved food court known for Asian flavors has reopened in, a, in Queens after a major redesign. Owners say they want to modernize with the times and are dreaming up something even bigger. CBS 2's Elle McLogan covers Queens and takes us to Flushing. Across the street from the Flushing Library and down a flight of stairs is what could be the most aromatic basement in New York City, the Golden Mall Food Court. We had a reputation where if you want the most authentic food, you come here. Robert Chang's family has owned the mall since the year 2000, starting up with a single vendor and adding more and more Asian flavors. A dessert for Castella cake. The Malatown is like a bowl of goodness. This is what? The after a gut renovation that kept its doors shut for four years, the food court has reopened with a shiny new makeover. The authentic look and feel in the early 2000s, you're not coming for the ambience, per se. Chang hopes the modern update will have broader appeal. In a food market, you know, where competition is, it's pretty scary. It served as a window into regional Chinese food for both homesick Chinese as well as New York City food adventurers. Queen's food writer Joe DiStefano says the mall helped shape the palate of New York, serving as a launch pad for big names, including Xi'an Famous Foods, which now has more than a dozen locations citywide. Something that this place gets praised for, it gave a chance and a start to people who maybe didn't have a lot of resources to get going with. Is that something that you take right. pride in? With the decor that we had back in the days, um, we didn't charge a lot of money. Here, immigrants used their recipes to build their future in a new country. Decades later, the resilient Flushing staple is planning an expansion to a second location in Lower Manhattan slated for later this year. In Flushing, Elle McLogan, CBS 2 News. And Elle is our community reporter covering Queens. If you've got a story idea for her, you can email queenstip at cbs.com.